Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today I'm going to show you how to use J. Um... Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today I'm going to do a three part series on how to use. Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today I'm going to do a multiple part series on how to create a slideshow in Drupal. And we're going to be using all sorts of stuff. We're going to be using views, we're going to be using jQuery cycle, um, we're going to be doing a second one with a flex slider, um, just pretty much all sorts of stuff. And I'll show you how to use the libraries API, um, and which you already got a taste of before when we uh, used CK Editor, we had a libraries folder and whatever. Um, so really we're just going to go through and we're going to do a slideshow. And then I'm going to show you how to customize it, how to theme it, basically how to take control of it. Okay. So, but before we get started, I quickly wanted to apologize about the time uh, in between videos here. I noticed it's been a little bit longer since we've done a tutorial, and we've, we've always intended to do, you know, maybe six or seven tutorials a week, you know, keep it moving. Uh, but because this is a side project for us, it is in our free time. Uh, ben and I both work full time and have freelance jobs. Um, it's, it's really sort of sometimes hard to, you know, find time to do these. But we just wanted you to know that, you know, we are still planning on putting them out at irregular intervals and hopefully sooner in the future. With that said, we actually do accept donations. Uh, we're going to keep the tutorials going free. We don't accept, you know, or we don't expect you to donate or anything like that. We want to keep them as free as possible. and We want you to not feel like you have to give us money for these. So if you feel like donating, please go ahead. If not, you know, you're just as well accepted, you know, it's, it's all good. So to get started here, uh, we're going to grab some modules. Okay. So let's go here and we're going to go to drupal.org and we're going to type in views slideshow. So we're going to be using views. If you're not familiar with views, that's okay. I'll show you the basics of it. Just maybe watch the first couple of views tutorials on level up tuts we'll show you exactly how to you know understand the basics of views but even this uh, if if you're just following along you should be able to handle this no problem okay so we'll click view slideshow and this module is really just an API to allow you to use different uh, slideshows it also comes with the cycle jQuery cycle API or the jQuery cycle module um, and that doesn't actually even include the jQuery library it just includes the interface to be able to connect to Drupal but what this does is it allows you to download you know an image flow image slider whatever uh, jcarousel any of these other slideshows can integrate into this uh, view slideshow module so you're not tied down to one specific specific uh, slideshow type Okay, so we'll just go ahead and download this. Okay, and I'm going to throw it into my uh, sites folder. I'm just in my, uh, let's see, in my modules folder. Okay, let's throw this into here. Cool, and now let's go to our modules. And we're gonna just type in slideshow. Also, if you're wondering what this is, why my menu or modules screen might look different than yours, I'm using a module called uh, Module Filter. It looks great, it's really easy to find your modules. It's much better than that long giant list that's in Drupal by default. So check out Module Filter if you're interested in having your module screen look like this, okay? And so I'm going to check view slideshow, and I'm also going to check cycle because this is just the default one we want to use, um, and and it works perfectly fine. If you notice, it says uh, libraries is uh, needs to exist, and so does C, uh, chaos tools. Chaos tools also you know you need for view, so you probably have chaos tools. But if you don't have libraries, uh, go grab libraries because you're going to need it. Okay, let's save configuration, and after that, we're going to create a uh, basic view, and we're going to get started. So. Um, I'm just going to click views here. If you don't have it in your shortcuts, it's under structure views. And then let's add a new view. And then the view name, we'll just call this slideshow. Nice and easy. And I'm going to uncheck this create a page because we don't want that. We want to create a block. 
and our block title will be slideshow. We're going to have five items on the page. And under display format, we're going to select slideshow now because it's an option. Okay, let's click continue and edit. Okay, so now that we have this here, uh, let's add an image to our content. Um, I think I have an image in project image that I want to use. Okay, project image, apply to all displays. Okay. I don't want a label, and for image style, let's choose this to be, uh, let's just keep this something small, this projects page one is really small, it can really be whatever you want. Uh, in the later lessons when we go over theming, we'll create a, a specific image style for this. So let's go to, we're going to link to content, and apply to all displays. Okay, so here we have um, what's supposed to be a slideshow, and in our preview, even though it says um, display five items here, uh, you're only seeing one item. That's because uh, the CSS is already being applied to it. It's supposed to be uh, cycling by now, but if you'll notice, it's not cycling. That's specifically because we do not have the cycle library installed yet. Okay, so if we actually click settings here, it's going to warn you about that. It's going to say you need to install the jQuery cycle plugin, uh, create a directory in sites all libraries. Notice if you don't have this folder here, just create a folder called libraries in your sites all. And it's going to be, you want this folder to be called jQuery cycle. Okay, and then you want your contents to just be the uh, jQuery module. It's saying it'll accept jQuery cycle all min or jQuery cycle all. Okay, you can find the plugins here. Um, here's a site, and you can just click and download it here. I've already downloaded them. Um, so let's. So let's throw those into our libraries folder. Here's my libraries folder. I'm going to create a new folder. I'm going to call it jQuery cycle. And we're going to put our cycle library into there. Actually, let me just re-download this. Save link as. OK, I'm just going to drop this into this folder. And now if we come back here, if we refresh the page, go to settings, check it out. No more uh, red error here. Okay, we'll just save this. We will save our view here, and let's throw this block onto a page, and we can see it in action. Okay, so let's add this block here. We're just gonna look for, uh, where is it, slideshow. View slideshow right here. I'm just gonna throw it on my content. Um, have it be on every page. We'll not worry about it for right now. Okay, let's just go to our main page and we're going to see our jQuery slideshow. If we wait a second here, as you can see it's changing. Alright, great, perfect. Cool, okay, so that now you have a slideshow. If you notice this doesn't have an image, that's because we didn't filter the content appropriately. So let's go ahead and do that really quickly. So let's go to edit view. And now we're just going to filter this. We only want, in this case, to be projects. So we're going to do content type. We'll just search type, I guess. Type, OK. And we want it to be a project, because all of these have images. OK, so now we should see only images here. OK, so this is how to get a basic jQuery slideshow up and running on your site. Perfect. In the next lesson, I'm going to show you how to customize it a little bit more. And then in the one after that, we're going to show you use a different slideshow module, um, something a little bit more responsive for those of you that are into responsive web design. Uh, we're going to be using Flex Slider. Cool. Okay, so this is jQuery uh, Cycle in a slideshow in views. If you have any questions, as always, leave a comment on the video or hit us up at Level Up Tuts at Twitter. Doc at Twitter. Um, uh, once again, this is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and thanks for watching. Bye.